Just fire away. Boop. <laughs> it's a rain of death. <laughs> oh, they have parachutes, of course. Hey, guys, and welcome to today's Let's Play of Scorched Earth. So, get ready to be injected with a huge heaping dose of fun. And as some of you might have noticed, yes, I finally got myself a green screen. Now, it is not a real green screen by any means. It is in fact a really cheapo green screen constructed out of poster board and held together by Velcro, which means it's 100% guaranteed to collapse while I'm filming. So, let's waste no more time and get right into this awesome classic 1991 game. It's a really fun game, which I used to play a lot as a kid, uh, which you have to shoot other tanks, and they shoot back at you, and the more kills you get, the more money you get, and the more money you get, the more you can spend on cool weapons and shields and stuff. So I am now picking my tank, and let's see, I'm going to go with the one that looks kind of like a shoe, and move on to select the computer opponents. Now, this is the easiest, and this is the most difficult. Uh, I don't want to send him to Moron because I actually do want somewhat of a challenge. And let's give that guy this tank. Let's make him a shooter. And uh, let's make a, one of these a, a tosser. <laughs> I know a tosser is like a kind of an insulting thing in Britain, but uh, let us begin the game. Now, basically what you have to do is you have to adjust the amount of power and the angle at which you want to fire. And um, you'll notice that I'm at the bottom there in the red tank. And I have to adjust the amount of force I want to give my shot and, and the angle in order to be able to hit him. So that looks pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and fire. Oh, wow, that was really off. <laughs> that was, like, way off. I can't believe how off that was. Okay, so uh, well, the AI opponents aren't doing much better than me. Let me aim a little bit higher. And then give it some more power. And try that. Oh, that, okay. Closer. I can get him. This guy's going to be easy. Everyone else is just firing randomly all over the place. Let's try that. Oh, I, oh, I, I missed him by a hair. Oh, oh someone, just got, someone just got hit. I missed it because I was talking. But uh, that's what the explosions look like in 1991. <laughs> Ooh, wow, that was really close too. I gotta do this just right. A uh, little less power. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> uh, sometimes the explosions are a little um, like you'd expect more from them to be a little more uh, explosive. <laughs> God, I gotta fire all the way over this mountain. And uh, as you go along, there will be more types of weapons to choose from, but when the game starts, you only have the baby missile. Oh, 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 you know what? The other thing is, you'll see up here the wind. The wind is blowing really hard. It is blowing at 168 miles an hour. That is a ridiculous wind. Um, but luckily, I have wraparound turned on, so basically if my shots goes around this way, I will be able to wrap around and hit him. It's just a matter of getting the angle right. Die, tank scum. <laughs> Sometimes the AI players will talk back to you once they take their shot, and it's kind of fun because a lot of them are like movie quotes or, I'm going to what in your face? <laughs> I missed that. <laughs> I'm sure it wasn't what I thought it was. And I really want to get this guy. Bam! <laughs> Got him. Wow. Okay, that took a while. I probably cut out like a good three minutes from the video just trying to hit him. Cool, I got $9,000 from it though. And uh, Gilligan, George, and Cleopatra got nothing. <laughs> All the uh, tank names for the AI players are automatically assigned. And it's funny because some of them are like named after famous dictators and whatnot. And uh, it's just really entertaining. So let's see, I'm going to buy some big missiles. I'm going to buy a roller. Uh, oh, oh, okay, I spent all my cash. <laughs> just like real life. Spent all my cash without realizing it. Now, I really like some of the terrains in this game. Like this terrain, for example, is textured. Uh, and the other one we just played was not. So the graphics are kind of cool at times, uh, although completely randomly generated. All right, let's see if I can get, once again, the green guy is the easiest one to hit here. So I'm going to increase my power. Let's try it. Oh, pretty close. Oh, oh. don't forget about me. <laughs> He's saying that because he went last, I guess. Uh, it's a little more power. And see if we can get him. Boom! 
Another one back to dust, and another one gone, and another one gone, another one got to dust. Okay, enough of that. I'm not gonna sing anymore. I'm gonna see if I can hit the yellow dude. Bam! Nope. That was off. Make my day. <laughs> I really want to try to use the big missile. Big missile has a much larger blast radius than the baby missile, so let's try this out. Aw, that wasn't much of a blast radius. Hmm, I wonder if th there's probably some setting I have to alter, but when I remember the big missile was like boom It was like it was a big missile <laughs> Wow, he almost like he was a hair within hitting himself Sometimes the AI players are just that bad. All right, actually I'm gonna try to change the game settings, so I'll be right back Okay, so I've I've set the weapon scale to large and I think that is what will allow me to have those large explosions Now this game is really customizable like you can change everything down to the economics and how much cash you start with and the Physics of the game you can there's like a load of options. There's many different ways to play So I'm gonna start a new game now actually Okay, so just start a new game here and um, hopefully hopefully now that the weapons will be how I used to remember them Let's try to aim for the green guy. Guys, it's always the green guy. Green guy is always closest to me. I don't know why. Ooh, ooh, that was close. Hasta la vista, baby. <laughs> like I said, a lot of movie quotes. Okay, let's reduce power a little bit. I can get him. Oh, 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 man. This is going to be rough. This is going to be close. I got to get him on this next shot or he's going to have me. Get it. Boom! <laughs> I didn't want to live anyway. <laughs> Sometimes I say the same thing. <laughs> no. Um, okay. Let's, uh, okay, we gotta get the, these other two guys now. I, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna aim this way since it is a wraparound. It's kind of a game of trial and error, and I think there was even a game that came before this called Tank Wars. Oh, yeah! Got him. I'm melting! <laughs> That's a Wizard of Oz reference. But I think there was a game um, called Tank Wars uh, previous to this, like a year before this game came out, and it's very similar in nature, and I, I have not played that one, but I probably should. It probably borrows a lot of elements from this game. My bomb is bigger than yours. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> I, I don't really want to find out uh, how, how large his bomb is, though. It's, that's, that's not of any interest to me. Or, uh, 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 oh, okay. Take this sissy. <laughs> you're the sissy, because you're going to die. <laughs> Mommy, is that you? <laughs> I don't know if some of these are movie quotes or not. I just, they're, they're funny. All right, I have 15 grand. Woohoo! I'm going to now buy some more lethal weaponry. I'm going to buy a baby nuke, which has an enormous blast radius. So you're going to see that right now as the map slowly transitions into view. Oh, oh <laughs> he, he completely fried Cleopatra, literally. I'm going to use a, use a big missile. Boom! <laughs> nice. Still not as big as I remember. Or maybe it was because I used like an old IBM PC from 1991 and everything on the screen looked way bigger than I'm actually seeing it now. That's that's probably the case too. Let's see, let's try to get him from the other side. Boom! Yes! <laughs> Got him again. Oh, that's, uh, that, that explosion was actually part of the funky bomb. Each time they explode, they explode in a different way, but it, they're actually weapons that you can buy which uh, are explode in the same manner. So now I'm back in the store and I'm going to buy some shields for myself. Uh, actually, I don't have enough for shields. Merchandise doesn't appear here if you can't afford it, so I'm not able to get any shields yet. But I can get a parachute. Uh, I think I will get a parachute. All right, let's just go on to the next round. There are eight rounds remaining. Wow, I gotta speed through this. Ooh, and he almost did break my face. All right, let's uh, do a direct hit over here. Boop. Okay, that that was really bad. I'm gonna use a baby nuke because I want to knock him out of the park. <laughs> there we go. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> awesome. Oh, oh, oh. There's some uh, af aftershock. Oh. 
Well, there I go. <laughs> In a funky ass explosion. In a funky ass explosion. Jeez. All right, now I have to wait for these two to duke it out. Oh God, they're idiots. Just waiting for this round to be over. <laughs> Eventually. All right, you know what? There actually is a way to just uh, go on to the next phase or the next um, round, and that's mass kill. Meaning, it's just like kill everyone, do it. Yeah, mass kill them. Bye bye. <laughs> then we can get on with our lives. Okay, let's see. So just to show off the uh, let's show off the dirt ball here. Um, I'm going to fire the dirt ball onto um, purple here. He's going to get hit with a giant cloud of dirt. Boom! Oh, there we go. <laughs> but I also have a baby nuke for him, so I'm just going to nuke the hell out of him, and all that land is just going to be disintegrated. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> this is the end, my only friend. It's probably another movie quote that I don't know. Boom. Boom. <laughs> uh, so the wind is blowing eastward now, so I need to try to compensate for that with my power and angle. Boom. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, that uh, that boomeranged really badly. It is a shame this game doesn't have any music or anything because that would kind of uh, liven up the experience. It's just kind of like beep, beep, when you're uh, when the shots fire. I just realized this guy's name is Bach. <laughs> yeah, some of the tanks are also named after uh, famous classical musicians, which I find really odd to mix classical musicians and uh, dictators. <laughs> it's kind of an odd decision, but okay, I didn't make the game. All right, so I'm going to start a new game briefly just to show you exactly how crazy this game can get with 10 tanks. And we will also start with lots of money, too. We can start with a million dollars. Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> that way everyone can have everything. And I'm gonna set all the AIs to be like super expert and let's, let's, I just wanna show you how insane this can be. Spoiler, <laughs> spoiler. <laughs> let's just set them all to be absolutely perfect. So I'm gonna be a little lonely player 10 here. I'm gonna name myself All Fack. All Fack. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> This is going to be absolute mayhem. Now, when you do have money at the start, you get to buy everything that's possible, like the Death's Head, which is like the most powerful weapon in the game. So that's fun. Let's get one of those, maybe, you know, three of those because we have a million dollars. Let's get all the shields. Let's get a heavy shield and uh, maybe four heavy shields and a parachute. And, and mommy, I want a pony and I want some napalm and I want a baby nuke and I want a heavy roll or regular roller and a riot bomb. Okay. Let's uh, let's go with a leapfrog, a funky. Okay, here we let's let's just have a weapon catastrophe. This will be wonderful, just like real war. Oh great, it's already starting. <laughs> Ooh, I've never seen that kind of explosion. Wow. <laughs> oh, <laughs> crapola. <laughs> See, this is where the game gets really fun. Is it just for uh, also the tanks I chose for these AI players are um, actually like special three shot tanks. So every shot they make turns into three bullets. Ooh, that was close. I almost lost my tank. <laughs> here's, here's my turn. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Let us use the Death's Head missile, and I'm gonna aim it, I don't know, somewhere. I can't even tell which direction. Oh, the background. Okay. Let's get the power up there, and just fire away. Boop. <laughs> it's a rain of death. <laughs> oh, they have parachutes, of course, because everyone has all the money. Oh, God. See, if they didn't have parachutes, they would just fall to their deaths. But, um, God, I should have started the video this way. This would have been amazing just to just go right into all the action. That was what I was doing before was boring town. <laughs> just like most of my other videos. <laughs> okay, I gotta put my shields up. Um, oh, yeah, when you right-click on this uh, top bar, you get to see exactly how much of each weapon you have and your shields as well. Uh, oh, there we go. Cool. I just applied my shields, and I'm going to deploy a funky bomb. Won't you take me to funky bomb? Won't you take me to funky bomb? Oh, great. I have a lot more dirt on me now. Ah, uh, jeez. I could try to use a roller, but it's probably going to get absorbed by a shield. Now, a roller is where it rolls down the hill and it explodes at the bottom, but not if it hits a shield. I'll try it, though. Oh, oh, it did. It did explode. It must have exploded on the dirt. 
You can tell the health of everyone's shields by how white they are or how black they are. If their shield is black, it's much closer to being destroyed. I told you to leave my sister alone. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> this screen ain't big enough for the both of us. <laughs> You know, this game's actually probably a lot more fun to play with human players than it is just the AIs, because the AIs are just kind of silly and it gets tedious after a while, but if I had more than one human player um, in in the room with me, which I, I, I don't think I do, <laughs> um, this would probably be a much more fun game to play, but it, it's a classic. I think it's a classic. Um, I, I love this game. All right, well, as you can see, these games can just kind of go on and on and on, kind of like my videos, so I'm going to leave it right here. Um, but if you guys like this video, feel free to give it a thumbs up. And uh, if you want, I can do more playing of this. Until next time, this is CS, signing out.